Hello everyone. Even though we were not able to meet in person this year, myself and the 2020 program committee would like to celebrate all of our young investigators and award winners for their outstanding scientific research and accomplishment at the 2020 ASBMR annual meeting virtual event. Before starting the ceremony, I would like to thank and acknowledge the hard work of the ESBMR Awards Committee, the ESBMR Scientific Program Committee, the abstract reviewers and category and poster chairs. In particular, Program Chair Lawrence Hofbauer and Program Co-Chairs Tamara Alliston, Stavrula Kusteni and Nicola Napoli, as well as Andrew Arnold, who serves as our Young Investigator Award Consultant. Their efforts help shape this meeting and allow us to honor the best and the brightest with us today. We're going to begin the award ceremony by congratulating the ASBMR Fibili Boy Professional Development Award. Established in 2012, this award recognizes a female young investigator who resides outside the United States. The award is named in memory of ASBMR member Phoebe Leboy for her outstanding contributions to the mentoring of young investigators, particularly women. The recipient of the 2020 ASBMR Phoebe Leboy Professional Development Award is Cynthia Kahari from the Biomedical Research and Training Institute, Harari, Zimbabwe, London School of Hygiene and Tropical Medicine, in London, United Kingdom. The next award is the 2020 ASBMR Royce Dresner Journal of Bonaminial Research First Paper Award. The award is named after Dr. Larry Royce, MD, who founded the Journal of Bonaminial Research, JBMR, and served as editor-in-chief for the first 10 years of the journal's existence. Dr. Mark Dresner built upon Dr. Roy's success by maintaining the journal's number one ranking, expanding its international reach, instituting self-publishing, and establishing a fully electronic presence for the journal. The award honors first authors of meritorious scientific publications published in the JBMR. This year's award recipient is Federica Scotto Di Caro, PhD, from the Institute of Genetics and Biophysics, National Research Council of Italy, for the paper, The Loss of Profiling One Causes Early Onset Budget Disease of Bone. The 2020 Program Committee oversaw the peer review and ranking of about 1,000 abstracts submitted this year, an unbelievable, challenging, and humbling experience. Over 150 of our colleagues helped with the peer review. The ESBMR President's Award recognizes the best abstract submitted by a young investigator. This year's award recipient is Shawan Debnath, PhD, from the Well Cornell Medicine um, for the abstract, the stem cell basis of bifurcation between adipogenic versus osteogenic lineages. The ESBMR Award for Outstanding Basic Science Research is given to the lead investigator of the highest ranking basic abstract submitted for presentation at the meeting. This year's award recipient is Falma Mohammed, BBS, MS, PhD from the University of Michigan for the abstract Discoiding Domain Receptor 2, DDR2, regulates in vivo skeletal progenitor cell differentiation, collagen matrix organization, and hedgehog signaling. The ESBMR Award for Outstanding Clinical Science Research is given to the lead investigator of the highest ranking clinical abstract submitted for presentation at the meeting. This year's award recipient is Sandra Giuliano, PhD, from the University of Melbourne, Austin Health for the abstract 
dairy supplementation reduces fractures and falls in institutionalized older adults. Uh, cluster randomized placebo control trial. The ESVMR award for outstanding translational science research is given to the lead investigator of the highest ranking translational abstract submitted for presentation at the meeting. This year's award recipient is Xinguen Yang, PhD, from the University of Michigan for the abstract augmentation of BMP signaling causes mid-facial defects in mice by a suppressing glucose metabolism. The next award was established in 2008, the ESVMR Felix Bronner Young Investigator Award. This award was created at the request of the ESVMR member, Mary Farrah Carson, PhD, who had agreed to make an annual donation in memory of Felix Bronner, PhD, Professor Emeritus, Biostructure and Function at the University of Connecticut Health Center. He was an urban scholar and a pioneer in the study of ways calcium affects the body. The recipient of the ESMMR Felix Bronner Young Investigator Award this year is Federica Scotto Di Carlo, PhD from the Institute of Genetics and Biophysics National Research Council of Italy for the abstract loss of function of PFN1 drives the development of a genetic and primary osteosarcoma. Next, we have the ASBMR Fund for Research and Education Young Investigator Awards. These awards are supported by funds donated to the ASBMR Fund for Research and Education. This fund is supported by individual donations to provide research grants and training opportunities in the bone mineral and musculoskeletal field. Our two award recipients this year are Samantha Weaver, PhD, from the Mayo Clinic for the abstract PHLPP1 and PLPP2 differentially regulate endochondral ossification and chondrogenesis. And Kosei Nagata, MB, from the University of Tokyo for the abstract, ranks three, protects articular cartilage by direct induction of PRG4. Next, we have the ASBMR Fund for Research and Education Young Investigator Diversity Award. The recipient this year is Claudia Cristina Bigetti, DDS, Master in Science, PhD, from the University of Texas at Arlington for the abstract, a simultaneous bone and muscle surgical injury model reveals age and gender differences in musculoskeletal healing. Next, we have the ESVMR Fund for Research and Education Young Investigator Emerging Country Award. The recipient this year is Priyanka Singh from the Postgraduate Institute of Medical Education and Research in India for the abstract Quantitative Histone Acetylation Analysis of GATA3 and PAX1 Transcription Factor Genes in Primary hyperparathyroidism. Now, I would like to invite Program Chair Lawrence Hofbauer and Co-Chairs Tamara Alliston, Stavrula Kusteni, and Nicola Napoli to assist me with presenting the ASBMR Young Investigator Awards. The ASBMR Young Investigator Award recognizes young investigators who submit top ranking abstracts to the annual meeting. These young investigators represent the future of our field in bone and mineral research. Congratulations to all. Thank my colleagues for serving on this committee and to making this incredible experience. I would like to offer my congratulations to all of our Young Investigator Award recipients. These include Tala Azar, University of Pennsylvania, from the great state of Pennsylvania. Lena Batoon, Material Research Institute, the University of Queensland, Australia. Cora Best, University of Washington. Scott Burks, Boys State University. 
James Burman Paget, City College of New York, DNC Chen, University of Western Australia, Ri Ying Chen, Harvard Medical School, Guillaume Courbon, Northwestern University Feinberg School of Medicine, Baba Krishna Das, VA Long Beach Healthcare System, Elizabeth Duco, University of Wisconsin Medicine, Caitlin Guerrero, US Army Research Institute of Environmental Medicine, Gally Guterman Ram, National Institute of Child Health and Human Development, NIH, and Sean Hallett, University of Michigan School of Dentistry. I would now like to invite our translational science co-chair, Tamara Alliston, to continue honoring our Young Investigator Award recipients. Thank you, Lorenz. I would like to also congratulate our award recipients. Zishu Jin from Baylor College of Medicine, Cynthia Kahari from the Biomedical Research and Training Institute at Harare, Zimbabwe London School of Hygiene and Tropical Medicine, Ho Jun Kang from Michigan State University, Ismail Karkake from University of Minnesota, Jenna Lesser from University of Maryland in Baltimore, Wee Li Yu in, from Emory University, Hiratsugu Bayakawa from Kyoto University, Mohit Mahatma from University of Sheffield, Adele Mandel from NIH, David Malstad from the University of Minnesota, Shangfei Mi from Zhengzhou University, Chase Pagani from the University of Michigan Medical School, Peter Sang Uk Park from the Hospital for Special Surgery. Congratulations again to everyone. I would now like to invite our basic science co-chair, Stavrula Custini, to continue honoring our Young Investigator Award recipients. Thank you, Tamara. I would like to add my congratulations also to our award recipients. Shukan Ki, University of Michigan School of Dentistry, Noemi Rosa, University of Campinas, Bavaya Senwar, University of Colorado, Betty Sham, Children's Hospital Los Angeles, Cassandra Smith, Victoria University, and Sophie Soling, Aarhus University Hospital, Amy Strong, University of Michigan, Tuli Swaminan, University of Jaivaskaila, Dana Trumpet, Skeletal Biology and Engineering Research Center, Christy Turin, University of Pennsylvania, Bowen Wang, Rensselaer Polytechnic Institute, Jian Liang Wang, Massachusetts General Hospital. Congratulations again to everyone. I would now like to invite our clinical science co-chair, Nicola Napoli, to continue honoring our Young Investigator Award recipients. Thank you, Savrula. And uh, it's a pleasure now to announce the next winners, starting from uh, Wen Zheng Wang from University of Pennsylvania, Zheng Wang from Texas AM College of Dentistry, Komal Wakas from uh, Erasmus Medical Center, Yulong Wei from uh, University of Pennsylvania, Karin C. Wu from uh, University of California, San Francisco, Zha Zha Xu, from Johns Hopkins University, Huiliang Yang from Brown University, Alpert Medical School and Rhode Island Hospital, Lutian Yao from University of Pennsylvania, Tetsuyo Yoshimoto from Indiana University School of Medicine, Junjeun Yu from Yukon Health, Wei Yu from uh, University of Pennsylvania, and Zhengyan Zhuo from the Chinese University of Hong Kong. Congratulations to all of our outstanding award recipients and our Young Investigator Award recipients. 
This concludes our awards presentation. We hope you continue in your excellent work in the bone, mineral, and musculoskeletal community. Thank you very much.